exercise 2.3 here some of the important notes which have to be known for understanding rank correlation matter when the measurement of two variable are not in the form of number but they are in the form of their rank then the coefficient of correlation between x and y is called rank correlation coefficient such measure of correlation coefficient was suggested by spearman hence it is known as Spearman rank correlation coefficients and it is also denoted by R. Here are some of the properties. First, the minimum value of rank correlation coefficient is minus 1 and maximum value is 1. Thus, it, the answer of the rank correlation coefficient will remain between minus 1 and 1. So, always the answer will come as 0 point in minus or in plus but it will remain between minus 1 to plus 1. Second, if rank correlate variable, rank of variable x and y are equal, that is rx is equal to ry, and then r will be 1, which shows a perfect positive linear correlation between x and y. Third, if rank of variable x and y are mutually re reverse, then r is equal to minus 1, which shows perfect negative linear correlation between x and y. When the value of two variable x and y are some arrangement of first and natural number, the correlation coefficient obtained by Carl Pearson method and Spearman method are equal. Here is the formula for rank correlation coefficient. First, when observation are not repeated, an observation which is given in the question and if it is not repeated, this formula have to be used. Next, when observations are repeated, then this formula will be used. You can see it's the same formula. The only thing is CF has been introduced. And for CF, this formula will be used, which will be more understandable with the calculation. The calculation and the exercise 2.3 will be continue. In exercise 2.3, here we learn a third matter that is Spearman's rank correlation matter. Let's start with the first question. Six companies are ranked by their two market analysis on the basis of their growth in the recent past now here there is the six companies are given and rank has been given as per their performance so here be sure that when the rank is given no need to do anything just take them all into your book just write down the rank which has been given in the question for the company a and b and the remaining That is the ready rank is given as per the performance. You can see the numbers are given 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. That's what the rank has been given to the company as per their performance. So here we have the ready rank in the question. Out of this rank, first of all, we'll find out D. That, that is the subtraction of these two columns Rx minus Ry. Means 5 minus 6. Here we get minus 1, 2 minus 4 will be minus 2 because ye value zada hai compared to this. 1 minus 3 again minus 2, 4 minus 2 ab ye value kam hai aur ye zada hai. So here the answer will be in plus. Next 3 minus 1 that is 2 and 6 minus 5, 1. So if we calculate next information we need is d square as per the formula, the formula Hope you remember moving to the this column like 1 1s are 1, 2 2s are 4, 2 2s are 4, 2 2s are 4, 2 2s are 4, and 1 1s are 1. Now, this time obviously, when we make a square, the minus minus get plus. So, out of this, let's take the total of sigma d square of this column. Here we get 18. Now, just take into the formula. 1 minus 6 sigma d square that is 18 sigma d square which is already we have removed the square so no need to put square over here huh? and the total number 1 2 3 4 5 6 6 6 square minus 1 then again 1 minus 6 multiplied by 18 here we get 108 here 6 square that is 36 36 minus 1 will be 
6 into 35, here we get 210. First, make a calculation of this. 108 divided by 210, here you will get 0 0.51. Now get it minus, here you get 0 0.49. So here we can say, Hence, the rank correlation coefficient between the evaluation of the companies is obtained 0 0.49. Moving to the next. An official has ranked 9 village of a sample on the basis of the work done in the area of Swachita Abhyan and Beti Bachao Abhyan by the villages. The rank are given below. Here the number of village and here you can see it's already given the rank. यहाँ पे आपको इंफॉर्मेशन ही रैंक दिया है अगर नंबर्स इस तरह से दिया गया हो तो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल रिमेंबर टू चेक इज एनी नंबर इज रिपीटिंग और नॉट वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन एट नाइन मीन्स नो नंबर्स मीन्स एक भी रैंक रिपीट नहीं होना चाहिए अगर रिपीट होता है तो दैट इज अनदर फॉर्मूला आई होप यू रिमेंबर वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन एट नाइन so no rank has been repeated to the any of them so just take the value in the, into the table now after taking information in table we'll just take a subtraction to find out the d 4 minus 6 here we get 2 minus 2 8 minus 8 0 7 minus 5 2 1 minus 1 0 9 minus 9 0 5 minus 7 that is minus 2 6 minus 3 that is 3 because the number is hai. 2 minus 4 minus 2, 3 minus 2, that is 1. Next, remove the d square. 2 2s are 4, 0, 4, 0, 0, 4, 3 3s are 9, 4, 1. And here we get the total of it, 26. Next, just keep them into the formula. 26 upon n here we have 9 9 square minus 1 6 multiplied by 26 here we get 156 9 9 9 is 81 81 minus 1 will be 80 9 into 80 here we get 720 1 minus, just divide this 2, you will get 0 0.22. Getting minus with 1, you will get 0 0.78. Remember, don't skip any of this step by doing only in the calculator. Remember to write each and every step very clearly. At the end, don't forget to write down that hence the rank correlation coefficients between the performance of the villages obtain 0 0.78. Moving to the next question. Question number 3. The following information is obtained by a survey conducted by a town planning committee of a state here the cities are given that is a b c d e the population is given rate of growth is given and in the question they ask to find out rank correlation coefficient between the population of cities and the rate of growth of the population here you can see there is no rank is given here they directly give you the information of population in lakh and the rate of growth in per thousand so out of this information first of all we'll remove the rank First, take all this information in table. After taking into the table, first of all, we'll give the info, uh, rank in the descending order, which is the maximum one, that is 57. So, here it will get first, next is 45, so we'll give the rank 2, next is 18, so here the, it will, city D will get rank 3, next is C, here we'll give the rank 4. And last one will give the rank 5. In the same way, we will continue with the RY. Here, first of all, find out which is the maximum one. This is the one. So, here we will give the rank 1. Less than 20 is 15. So, here we will give 2. 13 will get 3rd rank. And 10 will get 4th rank. And the 5th one will get 5th rank. So, after giving the rank, remove D. XY minus Sorry, Rx minus Ry. So here, 1 minus 3, we get minus 2. 
2 minus 1 that is 1, 4 minus 4, 0, 3 minus 2 that is 1 and 5 minus 5 that is 0. At the end we will remove d square that is 2 2s are 4, 1 1s are 1, 0, 0, 1, 1, 0. So here we will get 4, 5, 6. So sigma d square is 6. Let's put into the formula 6, 6. And here we have n5, 5 square minus 1. 6, 6 are 36. 5, 5 square means 25, 25 minus 1 will get 24. Five into twenty four will get one twenty. Divide them, you will get zero point three. Get one minus zero point three, you will get zero point seven. Hence, the rank correlation coefficients between the population and the rate of the growth of cities obtain zero point seven. Next.